In this video, we are going to present to you the renewable energy revolution taking place in the world. Hi everyone, how's it going? This is Richard Aguilar and of course, this is Arthur and welcome back again to our channel. But before we get started, don't forget to subscribe and smash the bell icon so that you will always be updated with our new videos. Today, let's talk about clean energy. And with that being said, in this video, you will see renewable energy technology that is gaining popularity worldwide. So, get ready to see the solar power revolution taking place in the world. And since we don't want to waste any more of your time, let's proceed to our number one. Number one is, Singapore aims to power 350,000 households with solar energy. Singapore has moved from oil to natural gas for cleaner power generation in the past 50 years. But Singapore's energy use now needs to be even cleaner for the sake of future generations. Calling climate change a challenge that requires us to change the way we use and produce energy. The Energy Market Authority said in a statement that Singapore's energy sector will need to evolve to remain clean and efficient. Number two is Solar Power Revolution in South Africa. A major energy crisis has affected millions of people's livelihoods in South Africa. A decade of mismanagement and corruption has left the national electricity grid close to collapse, regularly plunging much of the nation into darkness. Widespread blackouts can cost the country's economy up to $284 million every day. But the energy shortages are also spurring a new generation of entrepreneurs as renewable energy is increasingly being seen as the answer to the problem. Number three is world's first floating solar power plant in Korea. This is the world's first rotating solar power plant on water. Unlike other conventional facilities that are fixed on land, this module is designed to move along with the movement of the sun during the day, which increases energy efficiency by 22%.
The floating plant in Ansong, Gyeonggi-do province in South Korea consists of 1,600 panels that can produce 2,000 kilowatts of energy per day, which is enough to supply about 200 households. Number 4 is, Walden harnesses the power of the sun with floating solar panels. One small Colorado town is harnessing the power of the sun in a unique way with floating solar panels. Walden in Jackson County unveiled their new floating solar photovoltaic array at the town water treatment facility. The floating panels are the first of its kind in Colorado and only the fifth in the U.S. working together. The town of Walden Jensen controls Colorado Energy Office and Grid Alternatives Colorado were able to pull off the first of its kind project. Number 5 is, world's first solar airport is energy self-sufficient. A 20-year-old international airport in the South Asian city of Kuchi has become the world's first solar-powered airport. The airport can now produce more than 50,000 units of electricity with its new solar plant, making it energy self-sufficient. The airport's solar panels were made in China. Number 6 is, thousands of solar panels installed on Townsley Hub. Adelaide's newest high-tech business and housing prison down south is about to cash in. An iconic landmark is the new home to one of the country's biggest solar power plants with cheaper electricity on offer. Number 7 is Sunship Winds tender to install solar panels at 49 government sites. More than 1,200 HDB blocks and almost 50 government sites are set to be installed with solar panels after Sunship was awarded the fourth tender under a government program. The project, which will see more than 170,000 solar panels being fitted, is one of the biggest in Singapore. Installations are expected to start in early 2020 and finish by 2022. And that's all for now. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. 
If you have something to say about this video, please leave some comment below. Once again, this is Richard Aguilar and this is Arthur. Thanks, Thanks for watching and see you on the next video. video.